Next up is uh, MP Materials. So MP Materials has been getting a lot of attention lately and even more so recently with everything going on with Joe Biden, the infrastructure bill, with relations with China, with electric vehicle industry, and everything going on there. So a couple of key things with MP Materials is MP Materials is essentially betting that the supply chain like the electric vehicle supply chain is the best way to invest in this space. So rather than investing in a specific electric vehicle company or a specific, you know, like one specific brand, they're saying, okay, look, by investing in MP materials, you're essentially investing in the industry. Like, are there going to be more electric vehicles? If the answer is yes, well, then it doesn't matter if it's, if it's Tesla, if it's GM, it doesn't matter what the company is because if you think the industry is going to grow, there's going to be more EVs, well then MP Materials is going to have to supply more material, more rare earth magnets to supply all of these electric motors. It's that simple. So right now, the MP Materials is the largest miner of rare earth minerals in North America. Most of the companies right now that mine the specific magnets that's needed for all EVs is located in China, and all of it is currently still processed in China. So even though MP Materials mines the material in the US, they still have to send it off to Asia to be processed. Good news is, is that we're at a pretty, pretty soon, within the next 12 to 18 months, MP Materials is gonna be able to process all of this material in the US in their own facilities. So that is a really key thing because they'll be completely self, you know, self-sufficient. They won't have to rely on sending anything to China or anything to Asia and they can do everything in the US. And given, you know, the shaky relations between the US and China, um, you know, there's always a little bit of shaky relations between US and China. It'll be important that we have a US company that can mine the material, process it, and, you know, get it out to all of these EV companies, especially with what Joe Biden is planning on doing with the next infrastructure bill. Plan is to get, you know, thousands of charging stations, thousands of EVs, and the only way you're going to be able to have more EVs is if you have more of this rare earth magnet from, from MP materials. Another thing with MP is that currently they have... Their core asset is called um, Mountain Pass Mine. And this mine has about 800,000 tons of recoverable rare earth reserves at the mine, which is one of the largest in the world. And the thing is about with this company is that they estimate about 8% um, the, the, an average of 8% ore grade, which is much, much higher than other mines out there. So the quality of the mine is much higher than others out there. And it's the only US company in the electric vehicle space is continuing to grow. And Joe Biden's administration want to get more electric vehicles on the road, be a net zero carbon emission, you know, country. So all of this combined is really pointing to MP materials. And if you're betting on there being more EVs, well then, Betting on MP is like a no-brainer right now.